What is up, everyone? Welcome back to my YouTube channel, back to my face and my voice. This is an update video. Uh, <laughs> it has been quite a minute since I've really uploaded anything more than just live stream footage. You know, I've been I've been pretty consistent streaming on Twitch, but really not not consistent with uploading on YouTube. So I, I do want to change that. But so much to really update you guys on. So uh, yeah, buckle up. Hope everyone is doing well. And I pretty much wrote everything down like a notepad because I'm just like, I don't know how I'm going to remember all this. But um, first thing, I pretty much more or less, it, it should be sealed by now. Um, I've got my associate's degree. It took me a very long time to get it. Very, very difficult with all the accessibility barriers that I had faced from multiple colleges. If you're blind and <laughs> wanting to go to school, best of luck to you. A lot of people have done it. So I think you just have to get lucky with the college and hope they're very proactive because I, I know many, many blind people who have graduated with degrees. So it's not impossible, but it's definitely an uphill battle. With that being said, I am going to be taking, I think, um, a semester or so off. So because I have finished my associates, I figured it'd be best time to kind of actually officially announce that I'm moving to California. Some people may have already guessed that. Just a quick edit. I completely realized I forgot to mention where in California I'm moving to. I am living currently living in Los Angeles. So pretty cool. Love where I live. And then something else I forgot to mention is that for those of you who can't see, I have a mustache now. I should have mentioned that earlier, but yeah, I mean, I've had it for so long, I just haven't recorded the video with it. But yep, that's it. Yeah, I am officially living in California. And I'm currently getting California ID and like moving all that stuff over. But that's been really cool. And so obviously when I do that, that comes with uprooting like my school and blind services that pay for my school and things like that. So that's part of the reason why I'm taking the semester off. Another reason I am taking it off is because I am going to be studying for the CPAC. Some some of you guys may have seen me tweet about this, but I I didn't tweet this out, but I tweeted that I was going to be taking the CPAC and everything. Well, then I kind of just went radio silent afterward, and that was because uh, I actually failed the CPAC by like four points. So I was really, really close. Um, it was a pretty hard test, but it's still something, you know, I. I I definitely beat myself up about it for a while, but, and I should probably say the CPAC stands for a Certified Professional in Accessibility Core Competencies. So it's an accessibility certification because that's what I want to do in my career. And so I beat myself up about that for a while, but eventually I was just like, how do I word this? I was just like, I'm only, I only failed by four points. So it was really hard. And I had a lot of other complicating stuff going on at the time that I won't go into, but um, I just got to study harder and. That's what I'm doing with that. Um, let's see. I guess I'll talk. I mean, yeah, I'll talk about my new setup. So I don't know if you guys have noticed, but my setup has, how do I even describe this, has gone up significantly in quality, I shall say. Whether it be audio or video, I have brand new expensive camera, brand new expensive mic, brand new expensive everything. And, um, I, I can't really speak much about it, but I will say that I was given all of these gifts, um, but I can't say what they, or I can't I can say what they are. I just can't say who they're from or anything like that, but brand new mic, brand new standing desk, a bunch of different lights, like a, a new ring light, lights behind me, a new gaming chair, like new everything. Um, and so that's kind of what inspired me to make this update video and just kind of get back on the grind of YouTube. Because at the end of the day, I do enjoy making videos. I just, school is taking up so much of my time and energy. And so now that I'm not doing that, I can just work on more, A, things that I enjoy, but B, things in my professional career. Because school is great, but it just takes so much out of me. And uh, with accessibility, certifications matter as well, not just in education, so small steps, you know, but Let's see, what else do I have on my notepad? Or is that it? Mm -mm -mm. Okay, yeah, so I think besides that, I'm just gonna start plugging my stuff as usual. 
I do stream on Twitch pretty often. I try to at least like once or twice a week. So be sure to check me out there. Just twitch.tv slash Ross Miner. And then you may have seen me mention in the past the accessible gaming Discord. And that's still a thing, except long story short, we're I slash we are rebranding it to Disabled Gamers Discord. So everything's gonna be the same. Disabled gamers always welcome. Able-bodied gamers always welcome. It's just meant to be a place for a, a community for people to ask questions and re have resources for setups. Because um, no matter what disability you have, it it can take a lot of setup to actually start playing a video game. And you, you all have seen that through my various tutorial videos on how I play this or that game. Like it, it's not easy. So just having a central place to basically have that for as a resource for people is really great. And this uh, server will correspond with the slash r slash disabled gamers Reddit. So if anyone uses Reddit, go check that out. I am a mod there as of recently. So that was very, very exciting. That was kind of like the whole reason I changed the name just to have I felt like accessible gaming was just kind of like fragmenting the community. It would just make things confusing. So if there's just one name, it'd be easier for people to find because that's that's the goal at the end of the day. But um, I have a new video coming out about how I play Pokemon with this accessibility mod. So it's not, I made a video on how I play Pokemon. This is for the accessibility mod, um, basically how to get set up if you are blind and how it all works. Be sure to check that out. Other than that, you know, you can check out all the links and comments in the description on how to support me and all that fun stuff but yeah that should be this video and I'm just trying to think is there anything else I want to say let me check my list one more time no I I've said everything well I hope all you guys are doing well um let me know in the comments how you're doing of course you can always reach out to me for any disability or gaming questions on Twitter on Reddit mainly Twitter though if Twitter is still good Blah, blah, blah. Twitter will still be around. Who knows? But uh, yeah, thanks everyone. And we'll catch y'all later.